Hello everyone, my name is Nam Lee and this technology. Um, I'm briefly introduce 3D visualization workshop 2016 Herbert GSD. Um, the workshop consists of three sections, pre-production, production, and post-production section. For the first part, as pre-production, I'm going to talk about general process and fundamental idea about 3D visualization on the basis of the book called Understanding Movies. Second, as a production step, which is a core section, we are focusing on technical approach such as optimization of modeling, lighting, and rendering in 3D visualization. We also study different types of animation like data-driven or modified-driven animation. In the last session, as a post-production, we will learn editing and effecting for still image and animation. In order to understand the concept of animation in digital environment, understanding basic transformation such as position, rotation, and scale is so essential and important that you can expand and apply the knowledge to different CAD platforms such as Maya, After Effects, or the 3ds Max. Then we will develop the knowledge of animation. We will learn how to set up link in IK system for creating more complex animation in 3D visualization. Particularly, I want to share the scripted plugin called Ants, which allows us to create building animation easily by a few mouse clicks. And then we will learn how to control both particle system and particle flow, which is an event-driven particle system in 3ds Max. We can not only extract the trajectory from the particle, but also create blob mesh with the particle behaviors. I'm going to introduce data-driven distribution such as tree. In this case, we utilize numerical geometry utility and numerical environment utility, um, which are grasshopper plugin to generate landscape objects and point data. Then we simply bring the data to through this map to replace data with the plus tree to visualize them as form of animation or still image. I also provide you guys with several scripts to promote this process. Lastly, I will show how data-driven animation and visualization can be created. In this section, I will introduce optimal rendering settings of V-Ray. In addition, I am going to talk about different types of rendering styles for architectural representation, such as line rendering effects or conceptual rendering beyond the realistic one. In addition, we are going to study how to make a lighting simulation with EPW files as a form of time-lapse animation for shadow study in an urban context. We also think about how to make the environment for summer, fall, and winter. For instance, we will learn how to visualize tree and shrubs according to the seasonal transition. Events could be important when it comes to architectural visualization since it helps people to understand design intention by providing with descriptive information of the space or design. Plus, we will learn simple character animation and how to utilize motion capture file in 3D visualization. For the post-production in architectural visualization, I'm going to teach Photoshop and After Effects. In this workshop, I will demonstrate the editing and effecting for general working process. And also, we will learn how to create an animation with several images. At the same time, I will introduce very useful trick and know-how, including several plugins in After Effects for post-production stage. Also, I will demonstrate the process of the making digital markup. The first step is to take a video clip for the site or space. And then we can extract the camera position from the movie clip as a second step. And then we can render our modeling with the camera movement. For the last session, the rendering will be composite with movie clip that we took. 
We also talk about how to take advantage of existing reference files as to modeling, material, and rendering settings to maximize working efficiency. According to the time and schedule, I will introduce more interesting topics related to 3D visualization in urban, landscape, or architectural representation. Um, I'm so excited to share my experience in visualization with you guys. Um, let us join in the workshop for the challenge and fun.